two-day strike involving nurses from Lady Children's Hospital will continue into tomorrow. The nurses rejected a last-minute contract offer yesterday. As ABC 10 News reporter Perla Shaheen explains, nurses from all over the country are filling in during this strike. This is the first time in the history of this union that these nurses have gone on strike and they are making it known. Take a look. Both sides of the sidewalk are filled with people. They started at 6.30 this morning and the crowd has only gotten bigger and louder. This is what it looks and sounds like at the doorstep of Rady Children's Hospital. It's the first day of the nurse strike, with hundreds on the picket line demanding better medical benefits and higher pay. Their patients cheering them on from inside. Well, I mean, working extra, I'm exhausted all the time. I have to spend less time with my family at home. Some nurses brought their own children to watch. This poor wages has affected not just me, but my whole family and I want them to see how much support that we have. The nurses are represented by UNOC Teamsters Local 1699. The union has been negotiating with the hospital for almost three months now. We're not walking out, we're standing up. A union representative says they rejected the hospital's most recent offer over the weekend. We feel very confident that that would place our nurses there in one of the top areas of, of pay for our region in the San Diego market. Patrick Frias is the president and CEO at Rady Children's Hospital. He says they've brought in hundreds of nurses to fill in while the strike continues, but they hope to soon bring back their original staff. Over the next 48 hours, we're always open to getting back to the negotiating table, and we will welcome our nurses back on Wednesday morning and look forward to that. Nurses are less optimistic. We have a long way to go, I think. Perla Shaheen, ABC 10 News.